Dear friends, I still cannot believe it, but I have just been convicted because I asked a question about Moroccans. While the day before yesterday, scores of Moroccan asylum seekers terrorized buses in Amman and did not even have to pay a fine, a politician who asks a question about fewer Moroccans is sentenced. The Netherlands have become a sick country. And I have a message for the judges who convicted me. You have restricted the freedom of speech of millions of Dutch and hence convicted everyone. No one trusts you anymore. But fortunately, truth and liberty are stronger than you. And so am I. I will never be silent. You will not be able to stop me. And you are wrong too. Moroccans are not a race, and people who criticize Moroccans are not racist. I am not a racist, and neither are my voters. This sentence proves that you judges are completely out of touch. And I have also a message for Prime Minister Rutte and the rest of the multicultural elite. You will not succeed in silencing me and defeating the PVV. Support for the Party for Freedom is stronger than ever and keeps growing every day. The Dutch want their country back and cherish their freedom. It will not be possible to put the genie of positive change back in the bottle. And to people at home I say freedom of speech is our pride and this will remain so. For centuries we Dutch have been speaking the unvarnished truth. Free speech is our most important possession. And we will never let them take away our freedom of speech. Because the flame of freedom burns within us and cannot be extinguished. Millions of Dutch are sick and tired of political correctness. Sick and tired of the elite which only cares about itself and ignores the ordinary Dutchman and sells out our country. People no longer feel represented by all these disconnected politicians, judges and journalists who have been harming our people for so long and make our country weaker instead of stronger. But I, I will keep fighting for you. And I tell all of you, thank you so much. Thank you so much for all your support. It is really overwhelming. I am immensely grateful to you. Thanks to your massive and heartfelt support, I know that I'm not alone. That you back me and are with me and waveringly stand for freedom of expression. Today, I was convicted in a political trial which, shortly before the elections, attempts to neutralize the leader of the largest and most popular opposition party. But they will not succeed, not even with this verdict, because I speak on behalf of millions of Dutch. And the Netherlands are entitled to politicians who speak the truth and honestly address the problems with Moroccans. Politicians who will not let themselves be silenced, not even by the judges. And you can count on it. I will never be silent. And this conviction only makes me stronger. This is a shameful sentence, which of course I will appeal, but I can tell you, I am now more vigorous than ever. And I know, together we aim for victory. Standing shoulder to shoulder, we are strong enough to change the Netherlands, to allow our children to grow up in a country they can be proud of. A Netherlands where we are allowed to say again what we think where everybody can safely walk the streets again, where we are in charge of our own country again. And that is what we stand for, for freedom and for our beautiful Netherlands.